I bet you they get them all the time. Those are the same ones that, that vote to, uh, well, look, to look, keep the, uh, the band going. Well, look, look what happened. You want to speak of uh, uh, double-sided. When John Kennedy, as President of the United States, decided that he was going to sign the, uh, the uh, embargo against Cuba, the trade embargo, and Cuban cigars were going to be illegal, he sent his press secretary, Pierce Allinger, out to find John Kennedy used to smoke Upman oh, Petites. Right, yeah. He sent Pierce Allinger out to find every Upman Petite that he could find. Pierce Salinger found 10,000 Upman Petites. Once he found out that he had 10,000 Upman Petites, he signed the embargo. <laughs> of course. Uh -huh. I've only seen him smoke in public once. Who's that? John Kennedy. I was at an Army-Navy game. And it wasn't lately. <laughs> no, it wasn't lately. This was... And what he would do was, if he knew he was going to be filmed or anything, he would take that cigar and put it out in his pocket, in his suit pocket. And that's why he always had holes in his pocket. Always had holes in his pocket when putting the cigars out. Hmm.